There we go. Alright. Last time I did Banjo-Kazooie on the Xbox, now it's time for good old-fashioned classic Banjo-Tooie on the N64. Is it going so fast? Hello? <laughs> I've overclocked my N64. Hi, JoJo. Alright. Clean files. Let's go. So, this time you'll be able to uh, see the cutscene as it's intended to be played. With the music completely in sync. Kids these days, they don't know what they're missing. They're banjo too weak. Opening cutscenes are all out of sync. Ah, oh, fuck, these taquitos are good. <laughs> <laughs> No good, mistress still can't shift rock. Mm, mm, mm. Taquito, good. All because of that stupid bear. <laughs> Mumbo play well, has much of bear's cash. He's right, Kazooie. There goes your bird seed money. Don't be so sure, Banjo. Hey, look outside, everyone. Grunty the Witch is coming. Oh. Where, Kazooie? I can't see her. Oh, uh, false alarm bottles. Must have been some shadows. Come on, Boneface, let's play. I feel lucky. Even though this opening cutscene is really long, I always loved it. I don't know, I think it I think it does well to kind of set the tone for the whole game. It's like this is gonna be a bit darker still have that that level of whimsy i think this is this is where like more of the 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 british like not not grim humor but the, like the what's the word i'm trying to think of the word it, it's it's like the style of british writing where everything's just a lot more like blunt Sarcastic, I guess I should say. I think that might have been what I was looking for. Perhaps one of us should go take a look outside. Blabelda, our sister is waiting. <laughs> Quickly, we must go, or angry Grunty will be. Then get off me, you must, or move, I cannot.
It stopped now. I wonder what it was. It sure was noisy. Let's go take a look, Kazooie. B but it's dark out there, and, uh, I'll be scared. Bumbo much brave. Me go look outside. Back in minute. Definitely not go to die. What a sucker, huh? Come on, Banjo. Give me a hand. Kazooie! <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, mistress, I have failed you. Worry grunting mustn't get you out, your sisters will. Big Rock is so powers we must combine. Grunty sisters, you should not mock. Now watch as our magic blasts this rock. I love how you can you can you can see the rock just shrink. It's not blasting, it just shrinks and falls in the hole. No, 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 this cannot be. What's happened to little old me? Nice grunty looks. Lost weight you have. I hate bones, a body I need. Can you help with this little deed? Oh, yes, plan to ha help we have. So back to our castle we must go. I hope my mic hasn't sounded awful. I just realized my cable was loose. Right then, girls, let's fix me up. Then Banjo's hairy butt I'll whoop. That's not good. Miko, tell Banjo. Ah! Seen us, Bony Man has! Him we must whack! Leave it to me, he's no hassle. I'll kick butt, then back off, or er, then off to the castle! Blay! Blay! Guess I'll be having that bird seat after all, huh, Banjo? But you cheated, Kazooie. That's not. Oh. Everyone uh, must run. Uh, quick, Grunty, coming. Revenge is mine. I cannot miss. Let's see that furry fool dodge this. Yeah, right, Skullboy. And I bet she had two heads. No joke. Look. Uh, smell coming. He's right. Quick, everyone out. I'm not falling for that trick again. I'm staying right here. Then die. Hurry, you must. Ready to leave, we are. Hold on, sis. I'm nearly there. I've just been to blast that bear. Troops we will leave. Destroy area, they will.
stop. Wait for me, Mistress Grunty. No, no, Klungo. You stay here. I'll be back. Have no fear. Sorry if everyone could hear that. Me shifting my mic. Oh, Mumbo's head hurts. Look at our house! Well, at least everyone got out safely. Hang on, where's Goggle Boy? Uh-huh. Mo looks much unwell. It's worse than that. Grunty's killed poor Bottles! He wasn't the favorite character in Banjo-Kazooie anyway. Kazooie! Sorry. Grunty wreck house and kill Bottles. She must pay. Bear and Bird get after Witch. Mumbo, see you later. Great, I get to peck some more Witch butt. Let's go, Banjo. Uh, I have a feeling it's not going to be so easy this time. And there you go. You've seen the cutscene as it was meant to be seen. Cut. Where did Banjo's fucking chimney go? He had a chimney. Anyway. There is nothing for us in here. But a ruined home. All right, unfortunately, since this is the N64 version, we uh, might have some trouble with uh, with some lag spikes. Because unfortunately, this game was very big. and took up a lot of the N64's resources. I'm gonna have to get used to the fact that the camera rotates the opposite way from what I'm trying to do. I'm gonna I'm gonna collect everything, but I think I'm not gonna bother going back to Cheeto. I'm just gonna unlock the cheats I want to get. Because I don't want to. I know I can beat this game up and down all day long. I don't really know if I want to spend too much time dealing with the resource management. But I don't know. Maybe I will. Give it a more authentic experience. This game's so quiet. I'll turn it up a little bit. Oh, now it's a little loud. Okay, hang on. Oops. I accidentally added a marker on my stream. Okay, that's about better. Oh, 
<laughs> you is stupid. Yeah, eat shit. Clever Klunko hide behind magic shield. Throw potions in very predictable pattern. So there's a few things that are random on every file in Banjo Tooie, and, and this is one of them. Whichever potion, which which of three potions Klungo will use in each fight, I usually end up getting the the um the large one. I think I think most often through my playthroughs, I've always gotten the like the 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 red one where he grows big. Yep, yep, silo, yep. I know there's a way to get this early. And there we go. That was actually not as hard as I thought it was. Yo, what's up? I'm king. Oh, sorry, I got food in my mouth. <laughs> Your kingdom seems a bit empty. My people were scared away by those witches and their giant machine. I kind of like it quiet. Uh, sorry, there's still food in my mouth. I need to finish. Doesn't seem that important to me. But it is. There's a big kickball rivalry between the Jinjos and the Moles, which means there could be trouble if we don't turn up. Oh dear. Exactly. Anyway, here's an incentive for you to rescue my people. I believe you should go and see Master Jiggy Wiggy in his temple now. Jiggy who? Jiggy Wiggy. He's the leader of a secret and ancient order dedicated to the mystical powers of the Crystal Jiggy. Ancient order? Crystal Jiggy? You just made that up, didn't you? No, honest, it's all true. He's very important to your adventure, as only the Crystal Jiggy can open the worlds that you must enter. Can you show us the way, King Dingling? It'll be my pleasure. I don't know where this accent came from that I'm giving him. Not bad for a king, huh? Yeah, strange pet thingy was cool. Let's go and find that Jimmy Wiggy then. Meanwhile, while Banjo uh, <laughs> looks, uh, stands in a weird pose.
Come on, sisters. Time I lack. What's the plan to get my body back? Annoying your rhyming is. So stop it or we will uh, not tell. What, Jojo? No. If I must. B.O.B. this is. Big O Blaster, built by Mingy and me. It's fucking Mingy. Life force from ground, plants and creatures it can suck. Stored in the balls, life force is. Shower grunty with... Um, when tank full, <laughs> then new body you will have. An evil and heartless plan. I like it. How long will it take to suck up enough life force? Not slim you are, so plenty will be needed. So start blasting! Patience you must be. Target you must first pick. Hmm. That cursed jingling has just given the furry fool a jiggy. I reckon we should blast the Jinjo King. Auto-targeting B.O.B. has button you only have to press. Warmed up B.O.B. is, so begin with the firing sequence. B.O.B. has hit. Steal life force, he will. Unlucky B.O.B. was. Baron, uh, bear we just missed. Never mind him. What about that traitor, Ginger, uh, Jingling, Jing Jing Jingling? He's just a zombie now. Poor bastard. Successful B.O.B. was Jingling's life force we have. Right then, girls. Let's blast the whole island. This we could do, but big charge up B.O.B. will need. Hours it will take. And revenge bear will seek. Pah. I wouldn't worry. Banjo's got no one to help him now that m now that mole and jingling are gone. He'll never get to us in time. All right, long cutscene out of the way. Um, I'm going to try to not spend so much time in cutscenes and shit, because I think I've already gone through most of this in uh, in the other playthrough, but I, I don't know. Because I basically don't have anything else going on, so <laughs> it's either I read the cutscenes or... Just, I don't know, just blast through and talk to myself. <laughs> um, I don't ever really use them, but I might as well go in and get that Zumo glasses. You know, when... It's amazing how different like playing this playing this game on a, on an N64 versus playing it now on like a really high resolution screen. I, I when I played this on the N64, this and Banjo Kazooie, I just I never saw I I didn't ever recognize that the classes were transparent. I always saw the 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 eyes in the glasses and that was it. 
it wasn't until like screen started getting better that I noticed that there was eyes behind the glasses. Like I, I, I think I, I recognized that they were there, but I never saw them through the glasses. I just always saw their eyes as they look in the sprites. But like nowadays, I can I can never just I can never not see the eyes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, come on, I get it. Gingered! It's fucking ginging! Oh, Jinjo. Flight of the Jinjo. Yay, we got it. Okay, good. Ah, fucker. You know, I think I think the googly eyes that Rare gives everything, I don't know, for some reason the N64 era just always strikes me as like the most iconic time to use those eyes. Just because of how like polygonal they are and how imperfect they look, I don't know. The, the way that they do googly eyes now, it's just always, I don't know, something about it always feels off. But maybe that's just me. Greetings, O Chosen One. You have entered the sacred temple of Jiggy Wiggy. Approach the golden monolith if you wish to prove yourself worthy. I do. Jimbly Wimbly. Man, I see no matter how good emulators get, I mean, funny N64s get. There's always, there's always something. There's always something just wrong with, with this, uh, with this puzzle minigame. I, I've, I've never, I've never seen this, this emulated perfectly before. I still haven't. There's always something off. But, this is probably the best I've seen it look in a long time. Big blast! Uh, shoot the door. It opens. Congrats. Yay. <laughs> I just want to go to my hem temple. And that's probably the only way I'll, I'll end up 100%ing this game before the 24 hour mark is speeding through shit like that. If you think you're hard enough. Bah, bah, bah. Is that the fucking white Jinjo? In the first level? Free Jiggy for me. Speed up! Ugh. Yay, free Jiggy. Because the whitey lives alone. <laughs> Oh, I don't have grip grab, can't do that. Oh. <laughs> 
Yes, I am here, Jam Jars. Yep, uh, yep, uh, yep, uh-huh, uh, yep. Bye-bye. Did a rap on Diddy Kong Racing? I did. I, uh, I unlocked TT and now I am just uh, playing banjo. Because I, I didn't have anything planned after that, so I was just like, yeah, I just want to play banjo. Come here, Glosif. Ah, Bear and Bird here at last. Mumbo best shaman in game, so build new skull. Mumbo also want help, but must find magic creature. We've got a Globo. Must give magic creature to Mumbo if want help. Want Mumbo's help? Yes. Sure, we need all the help we can get. Throw it in Mumbo's bag. Gimme. Rrrr! Ah, oh, Mumbo get to be hero at last. Press B to see mighty shaman zapstick. Return me to my chair when want to be bear and bird again. I just watched a, a video the other day of a... Uh, I forget the name, the guy, the, I forget the name of the channel. But, uh, he did, a he played through Banjo-Tooie. With, uh, jumping as few times as he possibly could. Um, and I think he ended up being able to beat Banjo-Tooie with a total of seven jumps, and four of them were necessary before the final boss, and three of them had to be spent on the final boss. Blum blum. Oh no! Oh. Yeah, yeah, it's a sign, I get it. You can walk up, you can walk up, you can walk up, you go up. Jesus Christ, I, I hope everyone can't hear that. Sounds like a fucking drag race just took off in the interstate next to me. Jesus Christ, I will not miss living next to that. Alright, time to make tracks. We can get a lot of shit done if we just... Get a move on. Bam! Bang. Bang. A brown Jinjo. I, I get really lucky with getting a white Jinjo in the first level. Like, a lot of the times that I play this game, I, I, I end up getting the white Jiggy, or Jinjo in the first level. I forget how to cancel early. Unless you can't cancel early, and I'm just making that up. Well, that's all I needed Mumbo for.
God, ever since Grant talked about the 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 phrases that he said to make up Mumbo's speech, I can never unhear his phrase "Come on, have a go" if you think you're hard enough. In in this uh, in the Mayhem Temple track. Breed a boo ba bee ba day. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and get target sand done. Whoops. I think target sand easily takes the most time in this level. Oh, I gotta get used to the old golden eye aiming. Shoot with fucking birds, shooting with my bird. And I know there's a Jinjo in here I gotta keep an eye out for. There you are. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. Ah! The slightly sacred chamber. Oh, there you are. How did you know I was there? You cheat. Okay. Jinjo should be right here. Hello. Hey, do you fucking mind? Bitch. Uh-oh. No! Strafe! Strafe! There we go. <laughs> I wasn't used to strafing. I'm not used to strafing with, a, with the right stick. I'm used to looking, but I have to look and move with one stick and strafe with the other.
Oh, I can't get those rapid fire eggs again. Damn it. Banjo, there's another Jiggy. This is just too easy. Yep, we'll have the game finished in no time. Hopefully within a uh, within the next uh, 15 hours or so. Halt, Bortle. Thought you'd get another Jiggy that easily, huh? I am Targets and Mighty Mayan God of Target Shooting. Prepare to meet thy dark ridden doom. Fucker. Let's maybe not die to the first boss, bro. There we go. All right. No, you've beaten me. Now suffer as I invoke my sacred self-destruct. And I'll just uh, sit back here. Excellent. Beep. have to remember how to get out of here. Yeah, here we go. And if I can, I'm going to try to get every Jiggy I can on the first run through, including any Jiggies that I can glitch or like sneak my way around. Sequence break is what I'm trying to say. If the Jiggy can be sequence broken, I will most likely try to do it. Hey, wow, two purple Jinjos in one level. Nice. Amazing. I corn hardly believe it. You weirdly sorted those flies out. Yeah, I definitely need to get the grip grab to get that one. Or a well placed ground pound. That's fucking awesome. I didn't realize I could do that. Oh. 
I don't have any feathers. There's feathers right there. I'll just head here first. I hope I get the 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 funny the funny man hit hit his head on the silo cutscene again. I was happy to have gotten it in, in uh, my first playthrough. I, I would like to see it again. Make me giggle. It makes me do the full belly laugh. Funny mole man hit his head. I go hee hoo. Big heap, welcome to Little Bear and Bird. I'm Banjo, and this is my feathered friend Kazooie. Me Humba Wumba, best magic person on island. We heard that Mumbo was the best. Not true. Mumbo, amateur. Wumba, best. You bring global magic creatures here. You have Globo, want to give to Humba? Yes. And we'll just look past uh, how well you certainly haven't aged. Wumba called this Stony. Oh, yo, I know a thing or two about Stony. Hey, oh. Don't hit. What is my cord stuck on? All right. Uh, you know what? Actually, I might wait on the stony. I don't really want to go do kickball right now, and there's still plenty of things I gotta go do. Thinking about cheat codes, but I'm not sure. Maybe I'll put on super baddies. Yeah, maybe I'll just put on super baddies just to make it harder on myself. Yeah, I think the first time is always you get you get caught. I always love the cough sound effects that they put in these games. They're like, they're coughs and then they pitch shift them up. So they always just come out like. <coughs> okay, can I just get a concise direction, please? There we go. Shit. I was trying to be, I was trying to adjust very slightly. I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Speed this process along a little bit. Ooh. <laughs> oh yeah, okay. I want that. I don't I need that. Oh. Yes, 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 I know, I know. 
How about, okay, 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 how about this? How about this? I'll use the cheat codes that you earn in the game, and the only one, the only uh, hidden cheat code I'll use is uh, Super Baddies. Cheeto. And then... Bad. Uh, and I think it's just YS. Oh, super baddie, yeah, yeah. Super baddie cheat will make the baddies run faster. All right. And that's the only one I'll do until we earn the other cheat codes. I think that'll make things a little more fair. There we go. And now these guys should be very fast. Uh, relatively. They're still pretty uh, predictable. Putting on Super Banjo was fun, though. Highly recommend. Oh my god, those darts fucking soar now. You see those? Oh my god. Wow. Come on, have a go. If you think you're hard enough, you can poke up, you can poke up, you can poke up, you go up. There we go. <laughs> perfect. Absolutely perfect. Lemon Squeezy, welcome back. What's up with you? It's terrible. I can't find Target Sen's favorite priceless relic thingy. I think it may have been stolen. Tough luck. We don't care. Elf cheap bloaters and bloaters and and I uh, find it. Blah blah blah. Yeah, okay. Jesus, you're zooming. Are you sure you're not a baddie too? Damn, where'd you get a baddie? Oh my god, you do you are running. You're zooming, dude. <laughs> Jamming out to the the dulcet tones of one mumbo M jumbo. Can we please use this? Alright. Dead center, let's go. Let's go. Alright, I can either do this the fun way or the boring way. 
I vote fun way. Damn it. Well, that won't work. <laughs> and I'm not going to sit here and experiment with it. I'm just going to do it the, the intended way. But with a little funny N64 magic. Excellent. Where's the exit? I was right above it. Cool. Got your thing. You found Target Sense like Priceless Relic Thingy. Priceless. Give me Chinky. Way. God. I, I, the sound effects in old rare games are, are something else. They're unique. They're special. They but they have they they give me warm feelings in my heart. God, I'm I'm so sorry if you can hear those me every time I fucking hit my mic. I look over and I see the audio readout just shoot up, and I'm, I'm I feel so bad. Because I don't know what that sounds like, and I haven't, I haven't like listened back. So for all I know, it just sounds like, and it just rings like that. Wait, I forgot. There's one more thing I need to do outside before I am stony. Didn't hear anything. Well, that's good. Cause, cause the the readout, the mic readout is definitely getting something, and it's it's like almost to my speaking voice volume. Um, so I just worry. I, I mean, if it's that loud on the readout, I wonder what it sounds like. But if you can't hear anything, then I guess that's I guess that's a good good thing. All right. Let me see if I can just stumble into this moon before sun. No. Moon, star, sun, star, moon? No. Alright, I will have to come back when I have the pad, the code. Because I think that code might also change every playthrough, too. Shoot, shoot me across. <laughs> That's what I mean. They always have like such a specific sound to them. They're always so mouthy. <laughs> Like, what other game, what other game made today would you get, like, someone, just some dude, just some dude in the office that just record, like, I, I need a, I need a, just, just like someone spitting something out and just like, oh, yeah, yeah, I got you.
Okay, I know you can also get these. I, I, I normally I would skip this by using Super Banjo to just get over. But I learned recently that you can... Yeah, you can just get up with a couple flaps and a bang. I'm surprised I'm actually getting this first try. The, the guy that did this said it would take a couple. Okay, yeah, yeah there we go. Yeah, they said it might take a couple a couple minutes to of practice to get used to. Yeah, okay, I see, I see. Get away. It would help if the camera was a little bit a little bit more on my side here. Shit. God damn it. How did I nail that twice and now I can't get it? There we go. There we go. Alright, that's the timing. Just gotta go right from the edge, full flap, and then... Oh, come on! Damn it. Did you... Fuck off. There we go. Stop moving, camera, please. I have you just where I need you. Okay, let's pull it in a little bit. There we go. Ah! Shit, I didn't even- I didn't even flutter. No. Why? Off topic, have you played Dream Buffet? I haven't. I've uh I've I've been I've been a little frugal with my mon my money lately cuz we're uh, we're about to move. Um and uh we're going to need a lot of money coming up very soon. So, I mean, I, I probably I I probably could just could get away with getting it now and playing it, but I just Want to be want to be absolutely sure. Damn it! I want to get this. I want to get this jiggy. I've I've done I've done the trick a few times now. I can clearly do it. I did promise Han I would play it with them though, so I, I gotta get it eventually. Okay, so it looks like I can get away with... ...being slightly over the edge. God damn, this really is a little demanding. Either I'm nailing it perfect every time, or these first two pillars... ...are like, just slightly closer. Like, just enough where the timing isn't as demanding. But maybe that's just me being optimistic. There we go. Hit me up if you do get up and having a blast. I will do that. Damn it. That was way too, way too late. You gotta be kidding me, come on. Have I even gotten to that pillar? Have I just been fucking up at that pillar every single time? Damn it. 
Can I do it off this one? No, I didn't think so. Well, I didn't want this to be the next 20 minutes of the stream. Dude, it's so close. Uh, come on, this is the first one. You love watching trick practice? I mean, this isn't even, I'm not even trying to do this for a, a speed run or anything. I'm just trying to be efficient and getting jiggies before I leave the world. Oh my god. No, that's not it. That's not it. No, come on. Alright, I think I'm going to give it a few more attempts and I'm just going to call it. Oh my god. That one doesn't count. <laughs> oh my god. The, come on, dude. The camera just jiggles. I just need it to stay steady. There we go. That was way too early. No, I didn't. Okay. All right. I'm getting worse. I'm just going to, I'm going to call it. I'm just getting worse by the second. <laughs> All right, let's just go to Humba. Humbus Wombus. No, uh, I, uh, why did I jump back in? Cool. Alright, I go. I hope you guys really like that transformation animation, because it's gonna happen again for a third time. Lida! Welcome back! Prison compound. All right, I'm gonna need the password, sir. To free the trapped one, a star must appear before the sun rises. Another star appears, followed by two moons. Star, sun, star, moon, moon, sounds like. Star, sun, star, moon, moon. Hey! Yeah, that's another one of those things that's random every game is the, uh, the password. Ooh. 
Yep, uh, either Charity or Moobot. Uh, Moobot just drops the link every couple minutes. Um... Unfortunately, the uh, I didn't I, th I didn't think I didn't think I would be done with the Diddy Kong Racing as soon as I was. Um, so there's nothing the the those incentives are largely done for the night, um, except for like the spicy jelly bean one. But uh, there are some Starlight uh, centric uh, rewards that you can uh, that you can uh, redeem also if you if you care to. Oh, I forgot to get that Jinjo. Uh, if someone can remind me to get that Jinjo before I leave, I would appreciate it. If I'm walking out of this world and I don't have that Jinjo, scream at me. In, in, in the chat, just scream at me. Say all the things that have been on your mind that you've always wanted to say to me, but, you, but you've never wanted to look like the bad guy. I invite it here right now. Say every horrific thing you've ever thought about me. <laughs> I'm gonna take care of something else real quick before I do this. Now kickball. Welcome to my amateur kickball championship. Get me in this kickball biz. <laughs> <sighs> oh God, I'm already feeling the 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 I'm up later than I should have been, or than I than I usually am. Fog. Ah, if I can't have that point, no one can. Mine. Also mine. Take you. Nice. Absolutely played. Mine, you fucker. No, my yellow ball. Damn it. Offended, I missed the most iconic N64 game of all time, Diddy Kong Racing. How dare you finish it before I decided to open Twitch? I will never forgive you for this anyway. Happy charity stream. <laughs> was that what was, was that the, the, the rude thing that's been in your mind this whole time? <laughs> but uh but yeah, thank you so much for the donation. 
We haven't haven't quite built up the momentum that we have in past charity streams, but that's all right. Literally anything, any any amount raised for charity is is still a net gain, karma wise. It's all all going to a good cause. Mine. No, you bitch. Oh my god. No, dude! I'm getting stun locked. In kickball. On, in Banjo Tooie. Oh my god, this can't be where it ends. This can't be. Oh, come on. No. I'm highly offended that I missed it, and it's definitely not my own fault. <laughs> Honestly, I was thinking about uh, we, we I hundred percented it and everything got the got TT and all that, and I was genuinely thinking about doing uh, the second adventure where all the all the tracks are mirrored, but I just could not bring myself to do it. The the way I was holding my controller to play that was was actually hurting my my fingers. <laughs> so I just had to give it up. Back off. How about I just goal, goal 10. And fucking hang on to the one point ball so, so that I, I make sure I win. Yeah, you know what? That's what I'll do. I'll hold on to it right until the very end. Ha 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 ha, bitch. Ha 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 ha. I declare you to do Mayan kickball champion. Brett. Alright, now to go get that Jinjo. Get you used to live on that game. I, I I loved playing Diddy Kong Racing. Uh, this yes, I need the flight pad. Perfect landing. Alright, I believe that's just about everything I can do here. Yep, just two jiggies. One of them is... You know what? I'm actually not sure. Which one is it? That's the one that I can't get because I just know I can't get it. Did I get the... I got the Jiggy in here, right? I got this, right? I didn't! God damn it, I almost just left without that Jiggy. Something about stealing eggs off my sibling's platform is so very pleasing to me as a child. Dude, I loved playing that that mode with my brother. It sucked though, because I was I was a I was a little bit in the uh, uh I was a little bit in the I'm too dumb to play video games age. 
when uh, when I had these games, so I would only be able to play them to a certain ex like to a certain point, and I just would give up because it got like way too hard, and I could never get past it. Um, so for like that time in my life, I just never beat games, or not never, but like I would, it like meant something when I like beat a game because I was like, I haven't beat many games, and and I saw this one to the end. This is awesome. So I would like keep track of games that I'd beaten. Um, and now I'm like, I mean, now I'm an epic gamer and, and I, I, I game all day, every day. And I, I, I can't, I can't even count the amount of games I've beaten. There's just, there's so many of them. And there definitely isn't a, a, a bookshelf full of backlog of games that I haven't touched. Shit. Um, I, that is, all of that is to say, um, I played Diddy Kong Racing a lot, but I never ended up, like, I think I discovered the fourth world, the, the Dragon Village or whatever, but there is no chance I ever even got to Wizpig, let alone beating him. <laughs> Thank you, Lyda. I'm glad someone's taking notes for my biography. <laughs> for when I become <laughs> become a superstar gaming gaming fella, like that ninja fella. Ah, I am indeed the chosen one. Yes, I can attempt Jiggy Wiggy's challenge three. God damn, the fact that 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 the fact that that Jiggy I was trying to glitch my or uh, sequence break my way up to is the only Jiggy that's left in my M Temple actually kind of infuriates me. Because I could just go back there right now and just finish it. That world would be done and I wouldn't, I would say for one instance, I would never have to set foot back in there again. But I can't. I just can't. I haven't, I haven't put in enough time to get, get that trick down. So I don't, I don't really want to spend too much time just trying to get that one. I'm literally about to get the move to go get it. No longer the chosen one. All right. Uh, I'm honestly, I'm just gonna run in and grab the drill bill and just go get the shit I can get with that. Pass the fuck out and just woke up at 3 a.m. I fucking hope not. I've got a I've got a 24-hour charity stream to do. But yeah, welcome in, geeky. Uh, how it's going is I just uh spent six hours 
completing Diddy Kong Racing and then didn't have a, any plan for the remainder of the stream. So I'm playing Banjo-Tooie now. And I'm going to try to do what I didn't do last time and finish it before I'm done with the stream. Shit. Oh, get absolutely fucked. Please hit your head. Damn it. Do 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 and drill Gimme And now before I get too deep into this world I'm off Shit Oh, by the way, I want to I want to mention uh Wait, actually hang on before I do that. I want to try a trick. I want to try a trick I saw. Apparently this only works on the N64 version. to get this at just the right angle or I'm in the wrong spot no I think this is the right spot that's not it Nah. No, okay I don't know how to do it there, there's something about the n64 version you can you can uh just barely clip that Jinjo's uh hitbox and collect it without needing the build drill Anyway, uh, I want to mention to everyone uh, who's still in here, um, while t uh, Trouble and Tampanil may be on a hiatus, um, but I have been planning uh, my own campaign that I will be running very soon. It's not the same one that I was planning on doing um, uh, some time ago. Uh, not some time, like a few months ago. But uh, it's gonna be it's gonna be a different different uh, system. Um, I don't know if I want to drop what it is just yet, because uh, I'm still working on world building. But uh, Geekus will be in it, as well as Grace and two friends from back home. Booba booba wanna fuck a bee? I mean, uh, look at the honey. E. Oh, wait, I can get the fire eggs while I'm here. Hit your head, hit your head, hit your head. Damn it. Uh. Oh, there it is. Okay. Boop, 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 I've been thinking about how I'm going to get the art done for the game. Because I want to get some character art for everyone, but I'm not sure. Uh, I'm not sure who would be able to do it. Grace. 
grenade eggs. Let's go. Where's that? There it is. Jesus Christ, these enemies just zoom. Man, I can actually do quite a bit now that I'm thinking about it. I can go over yonder, not through the dead Jinjo house. I can go over here. And get something I need for later. A special tool that'll help us later. You bitch. Ah. Ever looked into doing a randomizer of this game? No, but I would be interested. I saw the Banjo-Kazooie randomizer. See, you know, I'm a little upset because I know Banjo-Kazooie gets most... Uh, I, because I know Banjo-Kazooie gets more attention, I, I, I never see any mods for this game. It's always Banjo-Kazooie, which I mean, understandable, but like, damn it. Banjo-Tooie's not that bad. People, people hate on it like it's a bad game or just completely overlook it, but I don't know why. Like, like, for all of its faults, it's still a great Banjo-Kazooie game. I don't know. It, it's like, it's like the opposite feeling I get from, or, or the opposite defense that I have for like, like black and white. Where it's like, are you guys fucking, like, you guys are getting hung up on the dumbest shit. Look at how good this game is. You're completely ignoring how good this game is. Now it's like, this game is really good, even though I know that there are some things holding it back. And I really wish people could just look past that and give it a shot, because this is such a good Banjo game. And realize people didn't like Tui. There are a lot of people who, like, rightfully so, I think, uh, people who just play, who just focus on how good Banjo Kazooie is and just don't ev ever really talk about Tui. Um, the biggest issues I see are that the game is too big, um, and worlds get confusing to 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 navigate, which I can agree with that. The 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 thing about I, I the, the way I heard it put best so so if anyone here knows Nintendo Capri Sun um he's an old school let's player um and he did a he did a in his own words uh like the fake sequelitis um just cuz he he uh, he wanted to do one in in the in the style of Aaron and uh did a sequelitis on a a fake sequelitis on on Banjo-Tooie and he explained something that I never really noticed but it makes a lot of sense the level design in Banjo Kazooie, all of the levels like center around one like a big landmark, which makes traversing levels pretty easy because there's always like the one thing to tie you back to the center of the level. Shit, just fuck that up. Um, like Clanker's Cavern surrounds Clanker, Freezy Peak surrounds a giant snowman. Uh, Gobi's Valley has a big pyramid in the middle. Like, there's always a big landmark in the center of the level to to, to tie you back. Um, to to you know to to so that you never feel like you're getting lost. But Banjo Kazooie or Banjo Tooie has like a lot of just interconnecting levels that are absolutely maze-like to explore, and that that is a problem. Yes. Um, in fact, the only, like, real 
exception in this game is like Mayahem Temple, kind of. Um, and, uh, oh, what's the level? Witchy World. Witchy World is like the best design level in this game, I think, in my opinion. W Witchy World's like my favorite level in this game. Um, but that one also, like, the level surrounds a tent, so it's, it's easy to navigate. Um, and I think that's like the biggest fault that, that Banjo-Tooie has that I agree with, is it's just the level design is, is complicated. Um, but I don't know, I've, I've just put so much time into this game that it doesn't really ever bother me now. There, there are still levels I get, I get turned around in, but I don't know. It's easy to look past faults like that when, when you're a kid that grows up with the game. But, if you take the time to make your way through the levels and just kind of, you know, learn them enough to just beat the game. I don't know, I mean, I, I some of the levels are, are, are chores to navigate, but it's not like all of them are. So, I don't know, it's... I don't know. I'm just kind of, I'm kind of going in circles at this point. I think this game doesn't get a good enough rap. And I think it, I think people should give it a shot beyond just getting confused in the, and lost in the second level and giving up. Or at least talk about it. Like, people just act like this game doesn't exist for some reason. Like, even down to just, like, dumb videos where it's like, uh, who would win in a street fight? And they talk about, like, <laughs> Banjo, Banjo Kazooie, but they only ever give like statistics about like them in Banjo Kazooie and not Tooie. I don't know. I'm just, I'm making up examples at this point. I can't see. There we go. Come here, cartridge. Oh, I nailed him. That's like the most fun thing to do in Spiral Mountain, I think. Is just... Send these fuckers flying. Oh. Wait, I think I can give Shito some pages. Bum 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 bum. And, and you know, I think the reason I think the reason I like this game more than Kazooie is because of how much more time I spent playing this game. Like the reason I know that I, I know the levels as well as I do is because this game is so big and I spent so much time playing it. Like, I don't know. It like I I I I, I understand how people like I, I understand the love for for banjo kazooie don't get me wrong um and it is a much shorter game and a much more concise game and and it definitely is just the nostalgia goggles when i when i say that like i love this game more than than banjo kazooie but it, re it really does for me personally just come down to like i was a kid this was one of the very few games I I like had at a time like at one time. So I played this game so much that I just ended up learning it organically over multiple playthroughs and and eventually learning like learning things on the internet when it was very very primitive. Um I just I just over time learned this game and I, and I love all the little things about it 
and I, it just I I don't have a better reason than that for why I love this game more than Banjo Kazooie, and everyone rants and raves about Kazooie, and I just kind of feel like I'm uh, I'm over here in my my Tui corner. It's a shame that people don't give this game the love they give to others in the series, and by others, of course, I mean the overwhelming love and admiration for Nuts and Bolts. Yeah, woof. And you know what? While I'm on the topic of underrated Banjo games, fucking... Uh... People need to... If you want, like, a, a nice... A nice Game Boy Advance platformer. Fucking Banjo Grunty's Revenge. That's a that's a, a, a pretty decent like top down platformer game. It's got jank to it, I'm not gonna lie. It's not exactly a strong entry in the series, but like eh. It's pretty 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 good for a Game Boy game. Tui is good, but that really is its greatest flaw. There were no cars. What are you talking about? Witchy World is... There's a car in Witchy World. There's multiple. You drive bumper cars, and you become a car. I don't know what people were, you know, so upset about. Like, it's not like Tui didn't have cars. In fact, not only were there cars, there was UFO. In the same... It's, witch, it's all Witchy World. It all comes back to Witchy World being the best level in this game. It's got everything. It's not the same. Ah, uh, well. To each their own. You know. I wonder if I could make this. I'm sure people have tried this. Yeah, absolutely. Thought so. Alright. I was thinking there was something else I wanted to try, but I, I, that was that was it. Yes, it's shift for Mr. Scrunty. Wait, I can make it to that one. I can at least feel halfway accomplished in that trick. I'll go up here and get the get the jiggy on the second lowest platform. There we go. This game is really missing the iconic and beloved character log. I think that's a huge downside, honestly. <sighs> I don't have much love for Log, I'll be honest. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'm just bitter because he's like literally the this like the same design that I had for a fucking comic book character. But then again, it's not exactly a hard design to come up with. Man with screen for eye. Or screen for face. Did I get the... I did get it, okay. Um, I'm pretty sure... Oh, wait, I want to go turn on feathers since I got that. Use that same trick to climb up the pillars. Yes, you can, but uh, the timing is very, very demanding, and I couldn't, I couldn't get it to work. I got up to like the th the second. No, I think I got up to like the third pillar, but I couldn't get any higher than that. No matter how hard I tried. I, and oh my God, did I try? Try all the time. In this. Institution. And he prays. Uh, 
there's Um, Banjo-Tooie shouldn't be rated E, because, as you can see, in the Cheeto room, you have the letters E, S, R, and A, but when you read those backwards, it spells arse, which is English slang for butt. Double feathers. It's funny, they call these cheats, but they're more like they're more like upgrades. Uh, hello? I had a net loss on these on this fucking honey. God, come on! Fucker. Arse puzzle. <laughs> God, those, those, st those, those statues really do just fire those darts like a gun now. Someone call Miyamoto stat. Miyamoto-san, Miyamoto-san. They're putting bad words in the bear game. Oh, Peggy's egg shed. God, Grant, excellent work with these fucking horns. <laughs> no, I've been meaning to watch Sakurai's stuff. Uh, I haven't had the time. But believe me, I subscribed the minute, the fucking second that I saw that first tweet. Also, I, I I have been seeing the tweets. I love that Sakurai basically said Nintendo's fucking NSO lag has ruined fucking Kirby's adventure. His poor game. <laughs> Even he's not safe from Nintendo fucking his shit over. In some way or another. Wait, did I get... No, I didn't. So that last egg is the, the secret move. I love that when Heggy uh, hatches the egg that unlocks Jinjo in multiplayer, I love that, I love that she's like, Unlocks Jinjo! Er, Jinjo unlock for multiplayer! Cluck, who is Jinjo? Alright, uh, Plateau. Every video ends like you finished a level in a video game. It's super satisfying. Ooh. Yeah, believe me, I need to get get to watching it. It has been on my list. Um, thankfully, I think this was like the last big thing I was planning for the week. Um, other than work. So, I think after I go to bed, after this stream, uh, I will have some time on my hands to watch it. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, get, yeah, get on with it.
Kazooie is Jesus. No, Kazooie is go fast. That's how Sonic do. Kazooie do too. Uh, I should have gone for that fucking that higher up one. Okay, grenades it is. Goodbye. Oh, I can't even get on this one. Oh, that's right. I did go to Royston. I almost forgot. Let me turn on the crushing shed while I'm here. Thought that one win already. Oh god, why did I do this? I can't see. Come here, yeehaw. Yeah. Come here. I'm hitting that wall. You know what? I'm going to have a second go at that, uh, that, that area that I should have jumped to. Flippity. Nah, the only way to pass, put, push past this wall is just to, to get past it. Oh wait, oh, so screwy. I might take a minute, uh, to go get a snack or like a drink. Yes, yes, yes. Jam jars. I know. I know. Uh, wait. 
Hang on. Nope, this is wrong. This is wrong. It's all wrong. That's the way I need to go to get out, but I need to... There it is. again was it oh I see it was this way shit getting turned around so hard there we go these two have a very impressive lung capacity yeah they learned how to breathe better underwater from a fish that was crushed under a boulder and was previously being barbecued. Shit. Oh, oh my god. Oh, wait, don't no, hear this. Oh, you fucking ye you've yeed your last hoss, sir. <laughs> oh man, you know what? Uh, if I could get the if I could get a funny PlayStation working well enough. I would love to play, uh... <sighs> I would love to play the Treasure Planet game on PS2. For stream. I would have to skip literally every cutscene because they play snippets of the movie in between, like, levels. I would have to skip every last one of them and it would hurt me so bad. But that's another game that, like, I think, as far as licensed movie games goes, holds up pretty well under scrutiny. It's a pretty, a pretty middle-of-the-road platformer, but that's alright by me. It was a collect-a-thon platformer, too. I thought it was pretty damn good for what it was. Um, let's humba. Because I can go do all the things I need with this. It'd be out. Nope, oh, different one. You remember that? Did you play that? Have you played the PS2 Treasure Planet game? I have of it is the surfing part at the start. Oh, yeah. No, the solar surfer levels are the fucking best. Um, but yeah, it's a it's a collect-a-thon platformer. Alright, later, Blair. <sighs> Bang. Yeah, you're free. Get out of here, you. Get out of here, you feathered bitch. Rock, rock, rock.
Dynamite Plunger Swim. Yeah! I'll just open that up in case I need to go back in there. That that was where I walked in from the flooded area and turned around. All right, there's one more thing I can do. And it's take out Canary Mary while she's in the open. Come here, you. Damn it. Assassination denied. Damn. better luck next time someone mod this game but the only change is that you can just you can kill canary mary and it cuts you off from getting the jiggy jiggy here and in cloud cuckoo land it's the only change i want get right on that if, if Justin if you can learn how to code and 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 program a mod for an n64 game just to just so you can assassinate canary mary I will kiss you on the mouth Yellow. Yellow! Uh oh. Have you guys seen the the video of the uh when, when I when I say that fucking when I say yellow in that dumb voice yellow another one another yellow uh d does anyone know what I'm talking about it's a, it's a video of this of this like 3D egg like these these two like Humpty Dumpty ass egg people and one of them just says yellow and they start dancing. It's it's a it's a it's a good it's a good video. I like it. I think about it a lot. Ah. Can't say you do. Here, hang on. I'll show you. I'll even show you how simple it is to look up because it's the dumbest shit ever. Literally just. Egg that says yellow. <laughs> Not clickbait. <laughs> yellow. <laughs> it's so 
fucking stupid. <laughs> Good content. Exactly as labeled. It wasn't clickbait. It's so good. I saw it once on Twitter and I like bookmarked it and forgot about it for like months. And then like I, I was looking through bookmarks on Twitter and saw it and I was like, oh my God, I forgot that this existed. And it's, it's like been stuck in my brain ever since. YOLO. Yo. When you're a kid, and and you have a CRT, and you can't fucking do this shit because you cannot see how because of how dark it is. But you live in the future where the screen brightness is just a built-in feature. Oh, I I wanted to try this trick, but I didn't get to. All right, forgot to. Yeah, damn it, that's so much easier. Forgot I wanted to try that. First time on Twitch in two years. Well, I'm glad that this is the stream that you decided to to be your 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 rebirth into Twitch onto. You pull up some jackass stream who's doing a charity event, playing banjo tooie, and you fucking you come in and and see yo. Remember you and Briar? What? I never fight that I didn't see this video in high school. You might be thinking of a different video. I found this one on Twitter. Like in my adult life. That's what I came in here for. Wait, isn't this where it came out of? Yes, it is, because this was how I got to the thing I just did. Sounds familiar, yeah. Play this on a 13-inch CRT. Yeah, yeah, playing this on a 13-inch CRT. The struggle is real. Something I've learned about, like, emulators that uh that do crt filters to try to try and mimic uh the the old-fashioned feel uh a lot of the, a lot from what i understand a lot of emulators don't actually do the crt filter right and it's just like a superficial like effect that's layered on top of uh on top of the gameplay but like actual crt filters that work the way that a crt would blend the pixels together and I saw this demonstrated with a with a, a, a screen grab from like a symphony of the night where like Dracula's like if you if you take a, a completely pixel perfect high-res image of Dracula from symphony of the symphony of the night um, shit there's actually one more thing I should have done with the, the dynamite plunger now that I see it uh, oh wait can I wait no, I can't. I can't blow this up with grenade eggs, can I? No, I can't. Um. Fuck, what was I saying? Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. So, so like, a, a, a pixel-perfect uh, image of, uh, of Dracula and Symphony of the Night, like, looks like, you know, pixely, like, as it obviously should. It looks pixely, but, like, the thing that that I notice, or the thing that 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 you're supposed to notice, is like the there's a, a red pixel in the middle of Dracula's eye, uh, where the pupil is, which you know, fine, whatever, it, it's Dracula, whatever. There, there's it's, he's evil, blah blah blah. But like on a CRT, 
you don't notice like that red pixel doesn't even look red because it, it like the CRT blends all of the pixels together so that the image doesn't look like a pixely sprite. It's supposed to look like, you know, a, a portrait. Um, but a lot of CRT filters will just layer the CRT effect on and all of the pixels remain the same so it doesn't actually work the way a CRT filter should. But there are some CRT filters and emulators that do work uh, that way. I just thought it was really interesting. For, for those... For, for people who are looking to, to play a game in its most authentic way um, that if uh, despite not being able to acquire the hardware yeah. I'd get if I anything to go back to those days playing multiplayer Halo 2 on a 13 inch CRT yeah <laughs> CRT is awesome if you didn't have a post dynex like I had. Honestly, um, I've been wanting to look into getting a CRT at some point. I know that they're they're a bitch to lug around when you move, but I think it'd be worth it. I do like me some authentic gaming. Plus, I can't play Duck Hunt. <laughs> I can't play Duck Hunt on anything other than a CRT. So, of uh, I I know that's one thing. It's one game. But it's the one game I can't play. I have the hardware to play most all of the games that I have. But that's the one that I have the hardware for, but I can't play it. By the way, if anyone's still looking to uh, donate to charity, f uh, 10 bucks and I'll eat a spicy jelly bean. Because uh, I still have a lot of these things. <laughs> and I'm not going to eat them on, on my free time. Weighed like a thousand pounds, yeah. Dropped a 32 down the stairs and went through the wall. Oh my god. Something I found out though about CRTs, apparently, um, I've asked Grace to look out for these because apparently, uh, a lot of news stations like have CRT monitors for like their old setups and shit. And a lot of them like have moved on to newer technology, but those CRTs are just still sitting around in news stations. Um, and like someone, someone on TikTok was like, talking about them and like uh, like their news station or someone they knew at the news station just gave them like four of them or they were get they were just going to throw away like four of them but they got one they were just given one for free and apparently these CRTs are like the equivalent of a top of the line luxury CRT TV um like a CRT like display so so with like some very very slight modifications for like inputs they're like the creme de la creme of like retro gaming CRT monitors because they're like the most authentic CR like the most authentic experience but like with the highest resolution it's like the best of both worlds Found the Dracula you mentioned. Yeah, that's yeah, that's exactly what I was talking about. Aren't they weirdly upgradable or something? It's it's. I don't think it's that they're weirdly upgradable. It's just that like, they have the wrong component. 
plug-in or something like that but like one slight adjustment like one replacement part that's super easy to install and it's good to go I forgot where I was going for a minute best place to find them are garage sales and stuff yeah Well, I will save you all the fucking trouble. This cutscene actually takes goddamn forever, and I'm not going to make you guys sit through it. I don't want to sit through it. I live in the future. I don't have to waste my time watching fucking cutscenes. I love that. I love that every piece adds onto the Jiggy theme. Now the train station. If you can get one of those news ones, best bet. Yeah, I, I've had uh, I've had Grace, uh, my fiance, who works at a news station. I've had her like I don't I think she said that they have some of those, but I I, I don't know if they're exactly getting them getting giving them away. But I uh, I told her like look if they ever decide that they need to get rid of those things, grab one. You're watching me on Xbox? Bruh! Man, okay. You're going out of your way to type <laughs> on an Xbox an Xbox keyboard just to watch my stream. I, I'm honored. <laughs> Thank you for being here. Bye bye, Mumbo. Here's another example, but with Mega Man X. Ooh, I want to see. Yeah, yeah, perfect. Perfect example. Mega Man X has great pixel art, but like, it, it's true. Like, look at it. Look at it not on a fake CRT filter or with like a perfect resolution image. CRTs are supposed to blend all those pixels together to make one cohesive image. to the wrong side of the mine. Just playing Rare Replay version earlier. Nice. Rare Replay is like literally the only reason I bought the Xbox One I have. <laughs> I had to buy a few, a few other games to justify having it, but Literally, when I bought my Xbox, that was the one game I came out with. Or, or rather, the one game I had planned to come out with. And you know what? The, the only reason I had another game other than that on my Xbox was because I they were having a deal at GameStop, not only for the Xbox. Hey, he did it! He hit he damn head! Um, 
the only reason I had another game other than that coming out of a uh, GameStop was because they were having a deal for the Xbox and they were having like a, like a buy two get one free. Uh, and I, or it was either buy two or buy one get one free. And I bought the the fucking uh, Gears of War Rare Replay Combo Pack. <laughs> yep, 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 I know, I know. Rare Replay Master Chief Collection are both golden. They are. And actually, when I... <laughs> the Xbox that we bought, like, had a bunch of fucking games still on it. And one of them was the Master Chief Collection. I don't know how. But I scored the Master Chief Collection in, like, seven other games for free that were just on the system. And I, I couldn't find any evidence that the, uh that the previous owner like hadn't wiped his account off the thing or like off the the xbox or anything it was just there oh my god Yeah, no, it is a strange combo. Like Gears, Gears of War, and Rare Replay. I, I don't know why, but I, I could show you. It's the, I could show you the game case. It's literally just Gears of War and Rare Replay, a, co a, a, a game collection, and then a separate game. I, I, it doesn't make any sense to me, but it's, it, it is what it is. I did not mean to shoot it. Damn it. <laughs> oh. I'm gonna kiss your dad. Apparently, Retro Arch has a very convincing reshade that mimics CRT screens called CRT Royale. Ooh. Maybe I'll maybe I'll I'll turn it on next time I play banjo. Going in circles. Are those the official lyrics of the song? Yeah, yeah. Gonna kiss your dad, gonna kiss your dad, gonna kiss him on the mouth. You know? It's a classic. This is the song you play when you are southern and have anxiety. Oh, oh, oh. 
Oh my god, I almost shot it. Okay, I think I know where the other ones are. There's two. Okay, last one should be over here. Yeah, there we go. A boom. <laughs> Try getting launch box running, but it kept corrupting. I haven't really had too many problems with Retro Arch. I did have a problem before I started to stream with it, though. Um, I had to get the version on Steam. Um, because for some reason the version I downloaded was just, it would work, and then it would inexplicably stop working. And that was really fun, like for no reason at all. I'm in love with your dad and I'm gonna kiss him now. Give me Jiggy. Alrighty. Uh, oh god. Alright, Canary Mary. I don't know if I have a turbo button, but I don't want I don't want to bother. I'm sorry, I, I I said it earlier in Diddy Kong Racing and it doesn't change now that I'm playing Banjo Tooie. I'm just I'm gonna just be humming music and singing along to music because it's just that this uh, this era of video gaming has all a grip on my mind and all of this music lives in my head. Canary Mary for Smash, ew. you back for the fucking page. Castlevania would work fine until I opened the launch box and then my frame rate would drop to five. Ugh. Sorry. You know what I would really love to get working? I've tried to and I don't, but I don't know how. I, I want to get an MSX emulator running because I really would love to play the original Metal Gear um, in the way that, that uh, Kojima intended it to be played. Because um, I, have, I have Metal Gear on the NES, but that version of the game is infamously hated by Kojima because it was not only done without his permission, or his or, well, not really his permission because it was Konami that owned it, but not 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 only was that that port not done with his knowledge, but it's also a, a mess of a translation and a, and a mess of, of his his original like hardware or not hardware his uh, original programming. Plus, I get to play Metal Gear Two also. 
Wait, no, I should just fucking play it on my Xbox. I've got the the Metal Gear collection that has, I'm pretty sure it has Metal Gear on it. See the AVG in episode about the NES horn? Yeah, of course. All right, uh, not objects and items, I need totals. Seven out of 10, uh, one Jinjo. I think that's all I can do right now. Pretty sure that's all I can do. Nope, I lied, I got one more. I need to go to the fuel, not the fuel, the train station. See, I say that, I say that I, I only have this one left, but now I'm trying to remember which ones I can't do right now. I know of one. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, I know one. I'll just have to figure out the other ones. Or the other one, because I know where one is. I am certain I do not have Halo 5. And honestly, at this point, I wouldn't waste my money on it unless I found it on sale. What if you found me Bambi 2? Uh... Like original DVD copy? Oh, what if I found Bambi 2 at GameStop? What would I do? Uh, if I found Bambi 2 at GameStop, I would probably bring it to the front counter and be like, Hey, uh, this is a copy of Bambi 2 on DVD. Do you, like, can I just take this? Like, this isn't something you guys are selling, right? And you'd probably say like, yeah, I don't know where that came from, man. You can just take it. <laughs> and then I would have a copy of Bambi 2 on, on DVD. Basically everything after Reach isn't worth it. I thought 4 was pretty damn fun. Until you get to the end of the game and the story just hawks a fat fucking loogie in your face. Did you ever see that TikTok of the girl who brought her own VHS of some movie? I don't remember at an adult store and they took it and won't give it back. Why did she like why did what? <laughs> what the hell? 
Um, I need to look at the jig jiggies. Because I'm not 100% sure which... I, I know one that I'm missing. But there's one that I haven't... I can't think of. I just want to make sure I can't just go get it right now. She's trying to be like, hey, I found this at her uh, at her own VHS, but I but I don't know why. <laughs> that's 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 interesting. <laughs> why they just keep it? That's so weird. Oh yeah yeah yeah. The other thing is Bully and Bill. That's right. Oh wait, then I can go get that because I, I I cleared out the I cleared out the boulder. Does anyone drink beer here? Uh, I mean... Technically? I had a Jack Daniels earlier, but like, one of those like... Down-home punches. I don't- I don't like, like, beer. Beer schnasty, tastes like piss. But if you like it, that's okay. I'm glad you like drinking piss. It's not even good piss. <laughs> <laughs> you sound like who? Bullion Bill or Dilberta? <laughs> or that guy. Yeah! Depends on the day. Yeah, understandable. You know, some, day, some, some days I work up feeling woohoo! And some, some other, you know. Some days I wake up feeling, yeah! And other days I just, I, I wake up and feel, no! Uh, Let's just go straight to Witchy World. Actually, no. I want to I wanna open up Jolly Rogers Lagoon as soon as possible. I'm going to go get that move that lets me get the uh, Dragon Kazooie. This section runs fast as hell, though.
You prefer Sichuan Sish Kazooie? What? <laughs> Excellent. I am the chosen one. Time to shoot your beam, Jigson Wigson. Oh, uh, shoot it, shoot it. <laughs> My timing was way off. to do the shart one too I, I i my timing was off and i even played the wrong one so what am i even, what am i even here for <laughs> okay han i will stop Boobies, boobies. Uh, I can't even afford the next one. Alright, if I want to go get Dragon Kazooie, like, ASAP, I need to learn the split up, and then I need to go learn the torpedo, torpedo Kazooie. back on the grill and the punters will never know oh I've been rumbled Teach me a thing. Hit your head, please. Oh! Back to back. Oh, we, we've been blessed on this day. Back to back jam jars, rare cutscenes, or rare, rare animations. Mr. BG, I have a question for you. First of all, that's not my name. And if you're gonna keep getting my name wrong, then you're not gonna f you're not gonna be finding yourself watching me very long. Oh. 
Mr. Jolly D's nuts. Haunt that that's not my name either. Stop. Mr. Vagine? <sighs> Stop! <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> How indignant. <laughs> Just whatever. It's the funniest thing to just brush it off. It really is. <laughs> anyway, you ever make too much pasta? Yes, I live with Grace. She, she always makes too much pasta. But we all we always end up eating it. So is it really too much pasta? You want to see something fun? What's that guy doing down there? Huh? What's that guy doing down there for? He has no purpose down there. He just he just exists down there. And now he's dead. Such is the way of things. I don't have a loved one to share pasta. <laughs> I don't <laughs> I mean, that sounds sadder than it is, but I swear my loved one's dogs cannot eat this pasta. <laughs> Bitch. Jolly's Roger Lagoon. And hey, here it is. It's Jolly's. My place. Come into my place and we will have some ginger beer. See, it's mine. Jolly's. I'll make that joke every time I come in here and it'll never get funnier. But time to disrespect your surroundings. <laughs> that was a brand new door. Have you any idea how much they cost these days? And take it out of my ass, Jolly. Yep. Wait, sub aqua egg gaming. What? I thought that was the torpedo. No, I'm thinking of the fucking. I didn't even need to destroy public property, or private property. I didn't even need to do none of that. The one I was looking for wasn't even down here.
Oops. Wrong spot. Justin, how many times have I told you every time you ask me when I'm going to play Hollow Knight, the answer gets further away. <laughs> I'm kidding. I don't know. I, uh, I I really don't have a good answer. I, I just, I just, I, I will eventually get into the mood to to want to wanna try it out, but now is not the time. I either die, I either get through here or die trying. Let's go. I will get this torpedo. Haven't asked in like a year. That's a lie, first of all. <laughs> Look, how about if I haven't played it by by the time Silk Song comes out, I'll play it. I'll play it when Silk Song drops if I haven't played it before then. Yeah, now it's going to be another year before he plays Hollow Knight. Yeah, good job, Justin. Just barely enough to get this, too. Can I ask when you'll play both of these? Uh, I don't know. It, I haven't seen really good reviews of that game. Man, fuck off, eels. Fast ass eels. I wonder if anyone's been crazy enough to try Jolly Rogers Lagoon without oxygen oxygenizing the wall. If I don't start feeling a little bit more energized soon, I might just have to call it. I don't know how much, uh... How much more attention the, the charity itself is actually gonna get for the night, but damn. I am, I am, I'm feeling it. I think okay. Here's what I'll do. I think once I uh, once I get what I'm going for here, I'll go get like a glass of water. Eat a whole coffee. I could do that. Open 
the chest. Stop having it be closed. Big Globo. Wow! Ah, oh, shit, I might have even been able to go to, uh... Or no, I can! I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to the next area and see if I can't afford the, uh, Clockwork Kazooie eggs. Shit, I meant to go up one more. Honestly, I might just call it now, and uh, here's why. I think instead of, because uh, I, I hadn't really had much time to plan for this. Well, I did have much time, but I didn't really take that much time. I didn't have much time in my day-to-day. -day. Um, I think instead of just making this one 24-hour thing, I think I'll just continue this uh, until... I'll continue the the charity event for the rest of my weekend until uh until I've beaten Banjo Tooie. I'll, I'll do some longer streams out of him, but I think uh I think for now that's probably what I should do. Cause I I I am feeling it. I need to go to bed. My energy is at a low. So yeah, I think uh I think I'll just save it here. And, uh, I can pick this up tomorrow. And I'll just keep the charity going for a little longer. Uh, uh, yeah, because this is going to be the rest of the stream if I don't. It's just going to be me yawning and trying to make excuses why I don't have anything to say. <laughs> 